Hi, in this video today I would like to show you how to work with a team project in Azure. Okay, so for example, when you are working in a team, you want to be say as a file you are working on for another person in the team to working with. So in this video today, I will guide you how to do it. Okay, let's get started now. And I will open my browser and access to the Azure Cloud. You can open Google and type in Azure Cloud. Okay. And here you click on the URL app.azure.cloud website. Okay. And then it will navigate you to the Azure Cloud here. You have to provide the username and password in order to access this page. Okay. So now here you take a look into the dashboard of this Azure project here. We have a workspace. Okay. You click on the plus button here to create a new workspace. I will create a new workspace E RTNVS. Okay. I click on create workspace button here. Okay. And then in this space, I create a new project. Yeah. You can create a project from the Azure IP project. Or start new sketch file. Okay. So when I choose the option to create a new project on the cloud here, I have to drop the RP file from the local. So that means I didn't choose this option from the cloud. I will open the Azure tool. Yeah. So here, I click on the file menu. I will select the new team project. Okay, so here I will enter the team project name. I will enter it here. My my first team work with Azure. Okay, and for the worst pay, I will do it from existing worst pay. I click on this one, and then I select the spy GNVS pay. Okay, I click on the Create the team project. Yeah. After that, you see here, I have just successfully created the team project on the cloud, and now I need to save. I I need to save the team project file to my local server. Yeah. Because when we are working in the file, so we need. Uh, we will save the. So the new chain of the file into the local PC first, and after that we will commit it to the cloud. Okay, save team project file. I will save it. I will select the location to save the file. So I will select this folder, save it up. Yeah. So now here you can click on the invite user to share the the file to the team member, or you can do it later. On. Yeah. So now here I will do it later. I click on open team project file. Okay. So here, there, when we are working in a team, we have some the icon here to indicate that uh, we are working in the uh, project team. Okay. So now here I will change this file name. Right click on this one and read name. And name it home. Okay. So now here, I double click on this one to open the home file, and in the home file, I'm going ahead to add some of the component here. I will add the plate holder. Okay. So be before uh, when we are working in the team, before we do some edit to the file, we have to check out, check out it. Okay. Check out. Yeah. So when one person in the team check out the file, no one can do any action on this file. Okay. Something like this. Image. Okay. I save it up, and then 
after I finish modification of this file here, I need to commit all of the chain to the cloud. So here, you right click on the home page and select option E, check in. Okay. And then here in the check in dialog, I have to provide the check in node. I can let it blank and click on OK button here. But you should, however, you should enter some detect here for node. Uh, for time commit home page. Okay. Okay. No, no, no. It is check in, check out again. Sorry. Okay. So uh, here, I open the browser and refresh this one. Yeah, you see we have a uh, my first team project, a teamwork with Azure. Double click on this one. Yeah. When you see the overview, we have a home page here. Okay. You can click on pre preview button here to view the, the content of this page. Yeah. Back to the home. So now here only me working on this one and so now I want to be shared with my team member so open back to this one yeah we have a team you can invite the user yeah or you can even click on this one open detail and you will share the project yeah and then you enter the email you want to be send the invitation email i will send this invitation to another account click on this button okay so now here i will open my other pc open the web page and this is my Azure Cloud project of other account. I'll refresh this one. Yeah, you can. I can see the host page changes by here. We have an icon here indicate that I have a new notification in the in this host page. Okay, so here. I see the message you have been invited to uh, share Ghost Pay. Please accept it. If you click on accept and view Ghost Pay, that means you can view the content in this way. Otherwise, when you click on the de decline, so you cannot see anything here. Okay. Accept and view Ghost Pay. Okay. So uh, you can even open the, the gmail.com and when, when the when the sender send the sender invitation email to you, so it will automatically send an email to the mailbox. Okay. You see here, we have the notification email from Azure Cloud. It said you have an invitation from gnvs.com uh, with the ghost page gnvs page. Click about to log in and accept the invitation. Okay. Now I will open Azure on this PC. And then firstly I have to log in to to this tool. Okay, so here I already I already log in. Okay. So on the menu, I click on the team. And I will click on the get and open team project. After that, I have to choose the team project from the cloud. Click on this one. And I will see, select the host by GNVS by and my first team work with Azure. Okay, click on this one. And get the team project. 
okay and then the last step you have to save the file on the local for easier editing you can also send invitation email to another person in the team okay otherwise you can click and open team project file to start working on the the, the new Azure shattered file okay yeah it's the home page okay all of the content of home page have been checked out here okay so now here if you want to do some modification i click on check out button here or i can right click on the home page and select check out yeah the green icon here indicates that you have successfully checked it out okay i back to my pc open azure and i'm going to try to check out this one check out yeah so here it's showing the unroll message it said you are unable to check out because uh, there are some people who check it out that means you cannot check it out again okay so now here back to this one and i do the, the undo check out And back to my PC, I'm um, taking out it again. Yeah. So now here, I will open this homepage and I will try in to add a new paragraph here. The image st sticky. Okay, so now here save it up, and I will take it, take in. Okay, add it. Uh, sticky, sticky, and paragraph. Okay. I open my, my PC. I team get on changes from the team directory. Here, you can see the sticky and the text paragraph had been added to this file. Okay, so here let me try to add some pieces here. From introduction. Mm -hmm. Service, services, and then product. Okay, double click on the product here. Try to add some image. Okay, something like this. Save it, and you select the introduction and press the shift button on the keyboard, and click on product. Yeah. So here you are going to select all of the new pet pieces, and now you right click on this one and check in. You add some comment. Edit. News. Parola. Okay. Okay. I open back my PC and I click on team 
We had only six from team directory. Yeah, you see all of the new file had been checked in and uh, had been added to this file. Check it out first. Okay, team get on chances. Yeah. Okay, so I think that's all for today. And after you finish this video, you know how to um, how to use the Azure to work with the team in a project. Okay, you can do you can create some workspace new project and share it with the team member for them to working on the same. Okay, I think that's all. And let me know if you see any issue. Bye bye. Thank you for watching.